Hola amigos, I'm Arvind Kumar and uh, I welcome you in a Spanish learning course, Spoken Spanish for Everyone. Today we are going to learn Spanish articles. Friends, article is very important in Spanish because article tells the gender. Without uh, article, we cannot know about the gender of a noun in Spanish language. Without article, we cannot use adjectives. Don't be, uh, don't worry. It's uh, very easy. Okay, let's begin. Definite article, the. In English, we have only one form of the, but in Spanish, we have four. Don't be afraid. They are very easy. L. L is for masculine, singular. La. For feminine, singular. Los. For masculine plural and last for masculine uh, feminine plural so we have four forms l la los las for the example el padre padre is father and because father is a masculine singular so we have used l la madre madre mother so we have used feminine singular, los hermanos, the brothers, masculine plural, las hermanas, the sisters, feminine plural. Good. Some more examples. El sol. Now, um, inanimate objects, uh, the natural objects, and everything in Spanish, everything that is noun has a gender. So we have to know the, uh, we have to remember the genders of the nouns. El sol. Sol is sun, and sun is masculine, so el sol. Los arboles, the trees. La vaca, the cow, el cabrio, los animales, now it's plural, las chicas, the girls, la nube, the cloud, el aguila, the eagle, here is uh, something complicated, we will talk later, very soon, wait. La tierra, uh, the art. Uh, the complication is that uh, el aguila. Aguila is feminine, so we should have used la aguila. But why? Why el aguila? Yes, we. Here is the rule. Don't use la before a feminine noun beginning with a or a. Both are a because h is silent in Spanish. They take L. El agua. The water. El aguila. The eagle. El hacha. The X. But there is an exception. Before an adjective, la is used. La alta montaña. Alta is adjective. Montaña is noun. And so we have used la alta. The high mountain, La Grande Aguila, the Great Eagle. Indefinite article A and M, both are same. Uh, we have uh, two forms because we prefer A uh, to the nouns that are that begin with the uh, consonant sound and N to those nouns that uh, begin with a vowel sound but in Spanish this is not the basis of the distinction of two forms but it's only gender of the noun un una un for masculine una for feminine both mean a n a n unos unas these are plural forms and naturally this does not mean Many is uh, instead it means some. 
Un hombre. A man. Una mujer. A woman. Unos hombres. Some men. Unas mujeres. Some women. Now we have uh, certain uh, article plus proportion combinations. We combine A plus L and we have all to the. The plus L, del, of the or from the. We al garaje. I went to the garage. Ella está hablando del accidente. She is talking of the accident. Our use of articles. Use definite article when talking of likes and dislikes. Definite article means the. Me gusta el arte. I like the art. Odio las películas de terror. Odio. I hate. Means I don't like. Las películas de movies de terror. Of terror. Películas de terror. Movies of terror. Means terror movies. Use la las to tell time. Means a uh, definite article, but feminine forms. El autobus llega a las tres. The bus arrives at three. La película comienza a la una y media. The movie starts at one thirty. Use el los. Masculine. Uh, definite article, the masculine, both uh, singular and plural forms, while, to, uh, while talking of days of week. Voy al cine el domingo. I go to the cinema on Sunday. Voy al gimnasio todos las, los martes. I go to gymnasium or gym todos los martes, every Tuesday. No article with nationality, words, profession, words, and the words that show religion, etc. Es español. He is Spanish. Aristoteles fue científico. Aristotle was a uh, was scientist. Scientist was his profession. Ella es católica romana. She is Roman Catholic. Roman Catholic is religion. Use a definite article for emphasis. Emphasis means to give stress. Tenemos un frío. We have calls. Odiamos el invierno. We hate. We don't like. Winter. La gente. The people. Now you will translate. De la gente. Of the people. Un gobierno de la gente. A government of the people. La paloma. The dove. De una paloma. Of a dove. El, el huevo de una paloma. The egg of a gel. Very good. El autobus. The bus. Del autobus. Of the bus. El es conductor de un um, autobus. His driver of a bus. El río. The river. Del río, of the river, al río, to the river, iremos al río, iremos, we will go, al río, to the river, el mar, the sea, del mar, of the sea, al mar, to the sea, me encanta, I love, 
me encanta ver el mar. I love to watch the sea. To see the sea. La playa, the beach. A la playa, to the beach. Vamos a la playa. Let's go to the beach. El cielo, the sky. Del cielo, of the sky. El color del cielo es azul. The color of the sky is blue. El pueblo, the village. Al pueblo, to the village. Ella va al pueblo. She is going to the village. La ciudad, the city, de la ciudad, of the city, a la ciudad, to the city, en una ciudad, in a city, en una ciudad grande, in a grand city, in a big city, vivimos en una ciudad grande, we live in a big city. So friends, how was it? Uh, I hope you enjoyed the lesson. I enjoyed the lesson. Keep practicing on. Practice makes a man perfect. So take care. Bye.